Hello, ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is. I'll give you a hint. It's almost 11 at night, and I'm bored out of my mind right now, so I picked up the camera, and now we're gonna do something. Can you guess what it is? Can you guess? If you said play a random game for like 20 minutes and record my reaction and put it on the internet to inevitably get a million views, you'd be right! So what game to pick out? <laughs> it's really easy to randomize this with your hand because there are no darn in labels. And it's amazing. Except I know this is Indiana Jones because there's a stupid blockbuster sticker on it. <laughs> Star Fox 64 for the... Atari it's just a prank bro Star Fox 64 is actually stupid. We're really gonna be playing Harvest Moon 64 on the Nintendo 64 by popular demand and by popular demand I mean like two people, but that's still people nonetheless So without further ado, I present to you the long anticipated and by long anticipated I mean like a month or so sequel to those two random videos that I did on Harvest Moon 64 I guess sort of all right. Hello everyone. It's back this awesome Let's Play series for a second time I guess because uh, all, all the old unlisted videos are still up, and you can watch them if you want, but I, I would highly advise that you don't. And it's not like, it's not like it had a failed recording of this where I, like, rambled on for a billion hours. Uh, and it's not like, it's not like I selected the wrong file or anything. You know what, I'm actually just gonna keep it on this, uh, on this file, because it's the first Winter, and I hate not having any progress done on my accounts. So we're gonna actually do the one that's not gonna be terrible. Uh, because we have a carpet in this file, and, you know, Harvest Moon 64 is not complete unless you have a carpet. That's just, like, a general rule. If you don't have a carpet, then you just, you're terrible at the game. Here's tomorrow's forecast. It'll be a warm and, and calm day. Alright, and C4. C4. Crash the game. Crash the game. Crash the game. Crash the game. Dang it. All right, uh, I'm gonna go up to C1 because I don't want to cross the game tomorrow. Uh, and then boom, boom shakalaka. And then we're gonna put things in here because it's not like I had a failed recording of this where I screwed up and ran out of inventory to put crap in. Um, no, it's not like I did that. That was, that would be an amateur, that would be an amateur move and I am by no means an amateur. It's true! We're gonna go outside now. And we're gonna actually get interrupted by these guys. How about this? Isn't it great? I just finished. Take a look! Yes, this is in fact the greenhouse of harmony. <laughs> I don't think anyone on planet Earth is gonna get that reference if they didn't watch YouTube back in like 2010. Uh, anyways, this is the greenhouse of funness where you can plant crops all year round. And it's amazing! And it lets you get moolah in the winter time without having to rely on eggs. This baby is the bomb diggity. It costs like a fortune, but it is still in fact the bomb diggity. Uh, and I put my uh, seeds, eggplant seeds in the in the thing. That that was that was good planning on my part. I'm not gonna redo this take though. Uh, actually, never mind. Never mind. This is still my first take. I've Never ever failed this recording before by doing stupid stuff and rambling for five hours. Um, that's not me. Uh, I, and I just put these eggplants in the thing, by the way, in case you don't have eyes. And also, these chickens are very, very easy to get caught on. I don't think it's evident enough with this footage, despite how crappy it is, how easy it is to get caught on these stupid chickens. They are so horrible. Their hitboxes are like the entire screen, in short. Oh, and also we have to... We have to feed our dog an egg. Because there's no plants that grow during the winter time. Okay, so I haven't said that enough times yet. Alright, then we're gonna go over here. Because this is where all the peeps hang out. This is where all the chillaxed, cool kitties roam. With this frozen lake here. With an awesome, awesome... 
awesome collision box. Then we can fish for a while, probably like 12 minutes, because I'm terrible at fishing. With this water that isn't frozen for some reason. Don't, don't question it. Okay, I got one. I actually- oh crap, jeez! I'm never this lucky ever with fishing. Then it, then it comes down to skill, which I think I haven't made it clear enough, but I'm, I'm terrible at fishing. Okay, I got two of them. I'll live with two. We could also give these as presents, I guess, but they're kind of crappy presents. I don't think anyone likes them. Just like me in real life. I'm kidding, maybe. Uh, now we're gonna buy a kitchen because, you see, you see, intelligent people, intelligent people would rush for the kitchen first because it's actually like a relatively cheap expansion to the house. I got carpet and also a greenhouse, but primarily a carpet. Carpets obviously take priorities over those, those silly kitchens. Those silly kitchens are silly. You don't need that inventory. Nah. Nah, man. Kitchens are terrible. Carpet is where it's at. And I'm... Ugh. An offering. Not many people give offerings anymore. I'm very happy. You're a spiritual person. What is your wish? I don't know. Uh, strength, I guess. I don't know. It snows quite frequently in the winter. Which may or may not have anything to do with strength. Also, can I just mention how incredibly freaking cryptic it is that you have to throw an egg in a pond? That specific pond to get a wish. I mean, it's obviously supposed to be an easter egg, but like, I feel... I feel as though the game could have hinted you in on it. To at least some degree. I feel like that's not a very... Not a very realistically possible thing for you to discover on your own. I'll just leave it at that. This is what... This is what Nintendo Power was all about. Except Nintendo Power doesn't exist anymore because the internet. Days like this are gifts from God. This game is getting all religious on us, even though I thought this game had like its own fake religion in it. Not to offend any of those... <laughs> you know what, I'm not gonna finish that sentence. HA! Alright, that was, that was a pretty good, that was a pretty good way to end that trip to the... trip to the Quran's place. The worst girl's place. I just axed the snow. And now that we have our greenhouse, we have just magical assortments of of pouches of many colors. Elliot's, your eyes are like my husband's, glittering like a young boy. Ha ha, that's okay, men. Men need to have a dream dot dot dot. You're pretty good at being insightful, Mrs. Potpourri's mom. And then we're gonna get cabbage seeds because... Best girl likes cabbage. These are uh, corn seeds, and I guess we'll buy like one of them because uh, I think Anne likes them. I don't really remember to be totally honest. Potpourri doesn't like them though. Potpourri likes flowers, which are super common, but they're only available in like a quarter of the game. So she's gonna be stuck at Yellow Heart for a while. Is she not? See you keep up the good work. I will try. I will try so desperately to heed to that advice that you have never given me ever once before. In the winter, it's cold outside, and just as you enter the house, steam wraps around your body. I like such moments. All right. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't really know. It's just like after after a given amount of time, it's it's kind of hard to make make witty comments of the same lines of dialogue over and over again. In case, in case you've never tried to... In case you're one of the very, very few people on planet Earth that have never tried to make a Harvest Moon 64 Let's Play series. Winter is severe and depressing, but not, but if... But if not for winter, we would not cherish the spring, right? Right! You're... Just the best at having opinions, just... 
staring at this overly large table for all of eternity until you pass out. Hello, best girl! When ground is covered in snow, it becomes so bright outside. I heard that people in the olden days read books with this light. I don't know why the sun isn't enough, but I'd be happy to visit the library between jobs! Classic Maria quote right there. I would have never known. I would have, this is actually a super rare quote. I would have never known that she would have been pleasantly surprised by my presence if I were to be visiting her library between jobs. This is, this is the kind of quality, quality personality that I just praise Maria for. Because she is objectively the best girl. Uh, this, that's chicken feed, 10 gold per meal. You can get as much as you like. I think it maxes out at 99, doesn't it? Alright, hold on. I'm just gonna, like, hit the up key on the control stick for, like, five minutes. <laughs> Indeed it does max out at 99, you filthy liar. We're gonna go ahead and go out now to uh, the place. It is locked. That's pretty good timing. 15 minutes past five. It's time to go to the bar and get wasted. Smoke weed every day. Good, okay, I'll get started tomorrow. Alright, you do that, hun. Ugh, my, my voice is basically dead at this point. Uh, 80 uses, yes it apparently does. Oh wow, like holy crap, my voice just started to die. And then it's it's now on a downward spiral. To, to just complete crap. Um, <clears throat> Alright, we're gonna have to end this soon. I don't know why it... Uh, suddenly died out after totally not 36 minutes and 50 seconds of recording because I definitely didn't do two takes of this. Don't you dare let any of those lies out there uh, make you think otherwise. So we're gonna have to end it off after just one day. I was gonna do more but now I'm not. In case, in case I didn't make that abundantly clear enough as it is. So it's been fun, but we're gonna put this series on eternal dormancy for like another month or so, which is in fact not eternal, but I don't care. Until next time, folks, I've been your host. Uh, I haven't done outros in forever, because I usually do like a stupid cutoff gag at the end of these videos. Uh, so we're gonna, we're gonna make one up on the spot. I was gonna do my old one, but no, we're gonna be hip and cool with the kids. We gotta modernize it all. We gotta modernize all of the outros. All of the outros that I did that are definitely public on YouTube. You can search them up if you so desire. They'll definitely be there. And also, my memory card is running out. Maybe we'll just have that happen again. That, that'll be professional, right? Gosh darn it. I, I was so close to having this be perfect, but no. That just had to happen. That's gonna kill me. That is seriously going to kill me. It is literally going to kill me. Shoot. I think that's a pretty good outro.